It's only happened that one time last election where uh, one of the two major parties can actually do it on their own under this new system they've had for 30 years now. Uh, well, I suppose that's not so new, is it? Uh, but, but certainly the National Party led by Christopher Luxon as of Monday is now the major governing party. Christopher Luxon is the Prime Minister and my good friend, my, my favourite politician in New Zealand, Winston Peters, is the deputy, at least he's job-sharing deputy with the leader of the other uh, coalition party, David Seymour. But, but the bottom line here is that there does seem to be a a sense that this new coalition government, this national-led coalition government, might actually change the change the world a bit over there across the Dutch um, in the sense that they may actually go to the genuine centre right and not uh, to the to the token centre left uh, that uh, there might be a bit of reformist backbone uh, being put up the the spines of the national party by the ACT party the other party in the coalition besides Peter's uh, led by David Seymour uh, that we might see some regulatory reform we might see some social reform we might see some economic reform that is only to the benefit of New Zealand which pretty as it is and a great place to visit if you're a tourist is not doing it easy either economically or socially and and certainly I think uh, one of the points that uh, certainly contributors to the spectator both here and in the UK have made in recent times is that uh, if uh, if Christopher Luxon succeeds in demolishing the legacy of Jacinda Ardern in terms of her centralist authoritarian government knows best mentality uh, that's really permeated right through the New Zealand politics and New Zealand uh, administration, then it will be worthwhile. And hopefully, hopefully we'll see those... Uh, well, those three personalities, so uh, Christopher Luxon, David Seymour and my old mate, uh, Winston Peters, uh, who I think politically is a waste of space, uh, somebody who should, be put, should have been put out to pasture about several elections ago, because you know, who, who negotiates coalition agreements on the basis of what's good for Winston rather than not necessarily what's good for New Zealand. I, I think, yes, have you, have you worked out, I, I don't necessarily think particularly highly of him, 